What I think makes Alex a great teacher, ultimately her love for her students, her passion for teaching, and then also the way she inspires everyone that she works around to be better and do better on a daily basis. I could spend a lot of time talking about Miss Whitener and the things that she does in her classroom that make her a wonderful teacher, but the two things that I think that she does that in impact student learning the most are one, she is a student of her students. She knows all about her students. Um, she knows about their personal lives. She knows about their um, what they love to do in the classroom. And I really feel like that, that targets their student learning and helps them be the very best they can be. The second thing that I think that she does that impacts student learning is that she is a student of her craft. She does everything possible to learn more about teaching, about being a better teacher, about being a better teammate with her um, grade level, and she searches constantly for ways to make her students better at what they're doing in the classroom, as well as what she can do better to help them learn. She's a fantastic teacher. I'm Alex Whitener. I work at Blue Ridge Elementary. I teach third grade, and I am Blue Ridge Elementary School's Teacher of the Year. My best day teaching at Blue Ridge Elementary was last year. I had a student that wasn't my easiest student, but we worked hard to build a bond, and he made exponential growth last year. Towards the end of the year, he gave me this little note at the end of the year. I'm just gonna read it to you. It says, you are the mom everybody wishes they had. I love you. That has been my best day teaching so far. The thing that I love most about my job is teaching math. Um, I love the hands-on activities that we get to do, and I love to find those students that think that math is boring and absolutely hate it. And I love to um, just see the love that they have grow throughout the year for math, and I love to help them realize that math is a lot of fun and very useful. My advice to new teachers would be just to um, give yourself grace. Every day is not gonna be your best teaching day. You will make mistakes and that's okay. Um, allow yourself to make those mistakes and be easy on yourself. Hi, I'm Allison Danner, Principal of West Bannon Elementary, and I have the pleasure of working with Ms. Stacy Herndon daily. The two most effective things that Ms. Herndon does to promote student learning is provide consistency and positivity and structure, which in turn builds positive relationships with each of her students and promotes student learning. She sets high expectations for her kids, always respects them, and maintains a professional attitude every day. Hi, my name is Stacy Herndon. I'm a second grade teacher at West Fannin and a nominee for Teacher of the Year. My best day of teaching is any day that I get to witness the light bulb moment for my students. It's amazing to be there for a moment that a student truly understands something and gets it. They have a smile on their face, their eyes sparkle, and the look of confidence they have is just amazing. That's something I will always remember and treasure. The thing I love most about my job is the students. See their hugs, smiles, their energy. Being able to watch my students learn and grow throughout the years is the most amazing thing. It's unbelievable the amount of knowledge and independence they gain in a whole year. And I'm always so proud of my students, even watching them grow through their school career. And my first group of students, they graduated two years ago. And I was so proud of every one of them. My advice to a new teacher would be to ask for help when needed and don't be afraid to make mistakes. Making mistakes will happen throughout your teaching career. This is my 16th year of teaching and I still have lessons that do not go as planned at all. Do not hesitate to ask for advice because your school will be filled with teachers who are willing to help in any way possible. One thing that makes Ms. Brown a great teacher is that she is always open to change and excited about change. Whether it's in the news crew room or in the library or when she's doing STEM activities with the kids or during robotics club, she is always willing to, to venture forth and gather new ideas and put them into action. Two things that Ms. Brown does effectively. Number one, her media center is welcoming. She always invites students in for whatever reason, whether she's teaching a class or they're trying to check out a book. It's a very warm and friendly environment for our students. 
The second thing she does is she is involved in all types of other things outside of her normal job duties. She has created a social emotional learning room in the uh, side room of her media center uh, that she spends time with students with. She also helps with our news crew in the mornings and then she also supports our STEM and STEAM initiatives with our uh, STEM creative arts teacher and all of our other teachers in the building. I am Ms. Tiffany and I am the librarian at East Fannin Elementary School and I have been nominated as Teacher of the Year. My best day of teaching is every day. Every day we have the opportunity to watch and to listen and to see something amazing happen. From the child who realizes that the letters form a word for the first time, to the student who shouts, I love library time Ms. Tiffany to the child who holds my hand as I walk him to his car at Parent Pickup because he trusts me. As an educator, we have the opportunity to experience the best day every day. The part I love most about my job as the librarian at East Fannin is that I get to interact with the entire student body and every staff member. I get to share my love of reading and build healthy relationships with everyone here at East Fannin. My advice to new teachers would be to build relationships with their students and with staff and also to bring and ask questions and new ideas to your school family so that we can grow together. Hi, my name is Mark Young. I am the principal at Fannin County Middle School. I was asked what makes uh, Ms. Thomas an effective teacher. And when I think of Ms. Thomas, there are two things that really come to mind. The first one is her skill in math. She is a very talented math teacher, which helps her work with our advanced students on their Algebra 1 and enable them to get high school credit. But probably the most important thing that she does and possesses that makes her an effective educator is her relationship with the students and her peers. Ms. Thomas has a great relationship with our students. She's well thought of by everybody. She works with kids at all different ability levels well. She is able to come up with strategies that will help students who struggle, students who excel, and she pushes those guys to be the best that they can be. Her relationship among her peers is just as well. She is a quiet leader on her hallway. Uh, she is a great employee and, and just a great person to be around. Someone that I really admire. Ms. Thomas is a great educator because she has skills, and because she uh, possesses a great relationship with her staff and her students and all the faculty here, and we appreciate her. In my opinion, what makes Miss Thomas a great teacher is the way she cares for her students. She teaches math, which is a difficult subject and not always a favorite, and she strives to ensure that her students are learning, and when they aren't, she does what a good teacher should and finds a way to reach her students. Whether it's alternate teaching methods, slowing the pace of the assignments, providing extra materials, or even volunteering her time after school, Amanda does it. She makes each student feel important in her classroom. Amanda not only helps our students here at FCMS, she is also a part of our night school program. Amanda has had many roles here at FCMS, and with each one she has accepted the challenge with a smile. I've had the pleasure of working with her for several years. Amanda is the definition of a team player all the way around, and I can't say enough on how wonderful she is. My name is Amanda Thomas. I teach eighth grade math at Fannin Middle School, and I was a Teacher of the Year nominee. My best day teaching was when I had a former student come back to me as an adult and told me how I had impacted their life. The thing I love most about this job is obviously working with the kids all day, but I also love my coworkers. It's like family working here at Fannin Middle. My advice to a new teacher would be just to love the kids. This job can get very stressful every day, and just keep in mind why you're here, and our purpose here is to better the lives of the kids. My name is Scott Ramsey and I'm the principal at Fannin County High School. Two of the things that I think make Ms. Housley a very effective teacher, uh, one, she keeps her students engaged. I have been in her classroom multiple times and the students are always engaged doing activities that really enhance their learning. That's the way you get students to learn. Uh, that's what makes people an effective teacher. Ms. Housley is excellent at that. The second thing I think that makes Ms. Housley an excellent teacher is she has compassion for her students. Uh, she currently is working with our resource room to make sure that students have clothes and food and 
toiletries and things like that that they need. So she cares about the entire child and not just about what's going on in her classroom. She is very effective in that and has a great amount of compassion for her students and, and I think that is the second thing that makes her extremely effective as an educator. What I think makes uh, Mandy Housley such a great teacher really isn't what she does in the classroom. I could sit here for hours and talk about how great she is with her students because all of that is true. But what stands out for me is what she does for her coworkers. Everybody watching this knows how hard the last several years have been because of the challenges that we've had to face with COVID. And Mandy is an inspiration to all of us. She not only faces challenges, but she does it with such a positive attitude, and that gives us confidence. It, it helps us believe that we can do the same thing, that we can overcome any of the challenges that we face. But the thing that means the most to me personally, and I know it means a lot to everybody else that works with her, is her level of energy and her enthusiasm that she still has for the profession. Even on the hard days, even on the days where we face so many challenges, Mandy reminds us that we are blessed to be in this profession and she helps us hold on to that joy. So I am proud to work with Mandy. She makes me such a better teacher and just by being around her and being her friend, I feel like I'm a better person. I am Mandy Housley. I teach ninth grade lit at Fannin County High School and I am the Teacher of the Year nominee. My best day teaching was when I had a student who consistently failed essays, who worked really, really hard, came in and got tutored. The very last essay of the semester he made an A on and I was really proud of him but when I handed it back to him and he saw his grade on it, seeing him be proud of himself absolutely made my day. So knowing that a kid who thought he couldn't do something was able to achieve it was the best feeling ever. The best part of my job is hands down the students. My advice to a new teacher would be to show yourself grace. Having rules and regulations and being consistent is important, but you're going to make mistakes and you should show yourself grace in the process of doing that. Learn from your mistake and do better the next time.